Hello dears, you are watching insert update delete in room database in Android X. In this video, we are going to perform search operation in database. So directly up to now, you have seen introduction of room database, how to create room database in Android X, how to insert values in room database, how to view and fetch the data from database and so all the data in card view and in this video we are going to see how to search the data from database and filter from all the data and update the card view so up to now you know that currently you, if you can view the data these are the all entries up to eight then on the back you can insert the data likewise if i want to add Roll number line nine, then Leo Petra. You can enter and values zero, then seven, eight, five, six, four, five, two, three, one, two. And then male or female, you can check that this is the male and click on submit. Leo Petra is inserted values in two values and click on view data and at the last nine leo petra and with the phone number you can see the data so male or female according to it this particular on the right top the triangle will be set and you can call it so up to now you have seen up to this much of progressing room database so in this video we are going to set filter filter for the search view we are going to perform and uh, let's start search operation from the room database of given values for that just we learn certain basics for that so first we need to learn according to api study i know that the api study and sdk version study is much more better to do anything from the basic it's a text watcher class in android sdk android dot text dot text watcher class for this one it's a public interface text watcher is we need to implement these three things one after text change before text change and on text change so we can alter that this one then we can perform the operation whenever we want so on text change we are going to perform this one inside the on text change method so it will filter the data while we are searching certain things if we back space our characters then it will research the operation so on text change is preferable to do search so move towards our step one these process is very simple and easy way of searching so up to now we have do this recycler view just we need to add this search button before this recycler view so we are going to take one edit text for the search and it will be placed before the recycler view and the particular search syntax will be update our recycler view as per our searching text so it is very easy you can do it very easily in simple manner so directly we are going to perform search in given data which are already fetched from the database and just filter out this one so no need to fire any query for that and just we take this edit text into our database file and this given activity underscore view i know that this is the recycler view over here we take one edit text width will be match parent height will be rep content close this one and we make this one and on the top control x just control v this one give the id for that edt underscore search and for this one we this that top to bottom of edit search so you can set the margin certain also margin top 10 dp 
then it is ready if you want to set hint over here likewise if i want to set search then it will be placed over here so padding and all those things i know that from the design perspective my hand is much more powerful for this one but uh, for the height i want wrap content so i think it will be fine yes this one if i want to make certain padding then you can set padding also of 10 dp first we search with the name with the student name if you want to set text color text size then you can set this one 20 sp scale point and text uh, color i think dark will be much more better for us so dark yes it's a simple thing design and search name okay you can search by the student name currently we are going to perform control sheet and go to the view activity for this view activity just find view by id for this one edit search equals to edit text find view by id r dot id dot edt underscore search so it is very basic and simple thing we have already we have do it so nice thing if you have missed this video of create database insert values and view database then i think that preferable thing is you can learn from the previous video part one and part two this is the part three of room database operations so up to now we have taken this search view and logic to filter the data it's a one more thing to logic because currently right now we are not processing the data and give the value to database and fetch from the database via query because already all the data are filled out in our database so just we filter out the data with the logic of filtering the all data it's a very easy and fast loading process so i always prefer that no need to do search and fill the recycler view once again one more time it is not good and preferable thing program point of view but if you are good programmer if you are good developer then you can understand that if once we have already loaded the data then why we need to load that data once again so just we filter out the data from the array list also so directly we can search from the array list and it will find for the array list perspective and filter out the recycler view with given data so it's a very basic thing if you learn from array list if you want to learn the array list then you can prefer core java what is the array list collection class and because it is very easy and simple way so these take another array list for searching perspective and if all the data means searching text is zero then we filter all the array list of search means temporary we hold the data in array list search we replace the all the data with current array list if we need certain text in this one then we first we filter out our search data then after that we insert into array list so just we need to add update our adapter only so it is very easy and fast thing fast process then to do above operation just we make one method so move towards the step two create one method for filter the data that method will do character text if length equal equals to zero then do certain operation and if it's not then another operation so in the view over here just we make one method filter method starts this is my comment view i always prefer these types of things because whenever we want to find we can find it easily so enjoy your coding 
public void you can name it whatever you want to data filter then string whatever the character text whatever you want to name it and over here just we want certain one another array list we want to take so we are going to take one array list with the same name just underscore search comma it's our another array list just we first fill this array list as per whenever we have this older student array list new space and control space semicolon it and just add this one to our searching data also search array list also so it's a very easy thing we have done it and for this one custom adapter we make it on the member level then control c then remove from here and declare as an class variable so over here we have made this one custom adapter because we want to update these custom adapter so that's why and for this one over here we are writing that character text equals to character text dot to lowercase then you can make that if it is in lowercase then directly you can write the local also local dot get default because many of the times these are preferable that all the handset the user are doing with their own local file with setting so I prefer these two things one is log and another is toast toast is for client or user and log is for developer so always prefer that you set all those things in log file so first we clear the array list first array list is will be clear because we want to fill with filter out the data so just we first we have filter this one we clear the previous array list then if character text dot length equal equals to zero then we have to fill all the data whatever the data in search then we fill this one likewise if you set that student array list dot add all method this one add all method uh, what exactly array list is you can search by on your own that core java perspective collection class what is these methods then student array list directly you can search we add all the data whatever in the search one in array list of search then uh, if you want to set the log file over here that load data comma all we have loaded all the data so that's why and in else just we load the data of filtered this one is the filtered data will be loaded so that's why we have mentioned over here then for this one in else part just we write that currently we write that in else part for then student student column in search one just it's a advanced for loop because uh, for the basic purpose or the uh, all the data who are the developer with uh, who knows that it is a for loop it's a certain different than your basic then if we find that student dot then student name we just we define to lower case because many of the time person are searching in the lower case only so that's why we have do this one in lower case with, with this one local dot get default always preferable thing then dot contains our 
character set character text then we can do certain thing then we can take that student things means take that value because mind well that in student class we have do all this stuff so that's why if the name is in that particular student name in our edit text then we are going to uh, catch that data and uh, put or add that data into our student array list so just write that student array list dot add that particular student who has certain name if you set like this t o then uh, whatever the name contains with the t o it will be added into student array list so it's a very nice thing filter out the data and after that if position you can set that customer inside the last part over here custom adapter dot notify data set change because array list is different so just one line of coding is needed custom adapter dot notify data set change because already custom adapter is filled with that particular student array list so that's why it's a simple easy coding you can do it on your own and it will it will be fine so let's see it's a very easy thing you can do it um, only basic method that if this one character text dot length equals to zero means all the data we have to fill and if not then we need to fetch that data whatever the student name contains that particular in search text then and then it will be filled out with this one student array list so it is very easy thing you can do it it's a filter method already we have set it that filter method for the text then uh, step two is ready and the last one step three very easy and basic thing just we need to add text change listener it is already we have studied what is text watcher class we need to implement certain things in on text change so very nicely and just we just call that particular method with filter method already we have built it over here so let's see and develop over here mm, inside the on post execute okay we need to do edit search dot add text change listener add text change listener mind well that over here you have done your semicolon then new then just press text watcher this interface say this one is the i so it's a interface and android dot text dot no copy scan already we have studied this interface all three method will be implemented automatically yes this one all three methods after text change on text change before text change on text change and after text change so already we have studied that we need to implement this one on text change method so we are going to write on text change so on text change here we are going to write only simple thing string text equals to s dot to string why we need to do because it is character sequence we need to implement it inside the string you can do it by your own logic currently filter then we set text just two lines of coding over here edt search dot add text change listener so very easy and basic thing just we run this one by a shift f10 or any else process so first whatever we have done first we take this edit text over here second step is we set filter method this one filter method then the third step we set this listener only three steps very easy and basic thing to perform the search inside the recycler view so let's see
press already we have pressed the shift f10 then let's see when the code is ready currently gradle building running then yes okay install that application gradle invocation finished then just we see the view data inside the view data this one is the search name and over here these are the thing up to nine uh, we have we can see this one Leopetra then just if we want to set um, with the jolly bean if we set like B nah, yes <laughs> already the search is very fast <laughs> okay so then you can press R then currently by that way whatever the currently getting with the R O then Rosie and Roger these are the with the R already very nice and good thing you can learn with this edit text and searching process so very basic if you press minus anything then already do that process if you want to search and make it on the contact number then also we can make this one so just few step advance then little more thing for the search perspective if you want to search by name search by contact number then we can add any line inside the filter class so go to filter class just copy this one control C and over here make the pipe sign or sign then change with the contact number then it will also filter with the contact number data so very basic and little bit thing or sign then we can make the search name or contact number whatever we want to search so very basic thing uh, and nicely we have placed this one in else part we have do this one so one more change i think we need press ctrl x and after the else part just ctrl v because i uh, if there is an data filled with this one then also we need to filter out the data with all these things so that's why just we press uh, after the else part so because all the time if or else we need to filter out our custom adapter and press shift f10 all things are ready and set it because we can filter with the student name and contact number also so press shift f10 then let's check what will be the output so all the time you can perform if you practice this room database then and then you can see what is recycler view how we can fill the data how we can insert the data um, video is just for the reference you need to boost up yourself by your practice so go to the view data if we find the already we have searched that ro rosie and all these things then mac and some graph over here if we minus this one then all the data should be filled so it's a nice thing so all the data over here because we write the custom editor outside this one so if there is no data length but uh, we just we are checking for this one if certain phone number i want to five then all the data is filtered with the who are containing five then filter with the two then which are the containing same sequence five two I want this one Maria Vega 520 so that's why 520 then that particular number will be search with the particular things so by the name of this one if you want to add roll number then you can find the roll number also but I prefer that if you find with the roll number or contact number because both are the numbers so that's why so if you want to search with the roll number then you can do it another class also or make it on the same thing uh, just replace with the roll number or student name and roll number then 
make you over here role number and just we change that now either you can find with the student name or you can find with the role number so just one and simple thing into role number because it cannot resolve thing because the role number i know that role number is integer so that's why so what we have to do we need to do string dot value of for this one you have to make this one your core java very sound so string dot value of that these thing can be uh, made by two ways one is automatic type updation means um, and the second is with this one string dot value of if you know that what is string class perfectly with your core java then you can this one uh, what we have done over here we change the integer to string to parse the integer to string you need to string dot value of or you can automatic type casting means you can automatic type promotion also here it's a another different way just i want to say that this one can i make the control c over here because i if you know that likewise if you want to do it by another way then you can plus and double quote and make this one ha <laughs> this one so very nice my core java is sound so that's why thank you thank you god so student dot roll number plus double quote it's a automatic type promotion and but it's a our own logic of developer but the pure way to develop anything this one to string dot value of student dot roll number then you can press two lower case and whatever the things press uh, shift f10 max your always i prefer that if your core java is sound and you can make the android very smoothly via you do not have to make um copy the code from another side so just you can do it on your own if you have getting trouble then you can solve on your own so go with the basics basics are very good then your programming will be good so our code is ready and go to the view data we can search by roll number i want roll number what we can say that already we have searched maria vega so uh steve silver roll number seven then directly we press seven then roll number seven is here so steve silver is here if you want eight then ellen mcgrath two then rosie menon you can search it on your own so that's up with this one so you can search the given data from the recycler view and filter out this one so up to now in this video we have seen that how to search the data from the database and filter out all the from the all the data and update the card view accordingly and practice for room database try it yourself up to now if you have seen video part one then you can insert the data and create the database part two you can um, view the data from the database and in this one part three you can search the records and filter out the your recycler view stay tuned for more because in next session we are going to perform update and in after that delete in room database so it is the basic practical things so enjoy your coding thank you from this way already we have finished search from database subscribe this channel like it share it this is student easy student management system because only for the beginner level if you are beginner for the room database then this example we are going to perform because only four fields so that's why uh, it's very easy and um, you can do it on your own so subscribe this channel don't worry be happy feel free to contact and share these videos with your friends and cousin person thank you thank you very much